ever seen a nigga cuz with no hands cuz roll a fucking backwood? Let's see this shit. We gonna see this shit today. down on us, man. All right. Well, we're going to do this sit down before we get started like always. Because this is going to be quick. Before we get started like always. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
far exceeding anything that we could ever even think of. Because that's why I tell them, I got saw that shit. I was like, I never thought of no shit like that. Never. It's easy to come to people's minds, right? That's it. I got nothing for you, Pops. Is, um, oh, shit, that wasn't it, was it? Oh, yeah. It's a bad thing. Yeah, because this man here, the things that he do, and whatnot, and then the things that we do, cross the path, like you give him, like LGBT, whatever, blah, 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 alphabet, person, and then you take, you take, like Israel, like, put him in the middle of that. Um, he, he can't just be, he's got to I ain't. He just can't be. He's got to be over the top. I mean, look at RuPaul. RuPaul made a career of being over the top. Look at Matt Johnson's son. Oh, and look at Dwayne Wade's son. Oh, my. <laughs> and, and, and it's crazy because RuPaul was the epitome of that bullshit. That's why I thought Matt Johnson's son came along. I'm like, a 6 motherfucker. Are you serious? He as big as his daddy, and he out there like that. Mm-hmm. And, 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 and his wife fostered that because she wouldn't let him do that around his dad. Damn. Yeah, I remember, I remember catching that part of it. No, where he was on the road at practice that's playing she, ball, she let him go out and be a little. Yeah, but that's when she would let him off there when he come back. You know, you have to rein it in or whatnot. So she fought she fostered that. She built that up. And and the way ways so Yeah. You you didn't see that them tendencies of him until he got with Oh girl. That's yeah, right. Yeah. That's right. So you didn't see that. To be her um uh, uh, the woman became a wickedness. Mm-hmm. I'm paraphrasing. All right. So yeah, so this is this is this whole thing. So this, this weekend is that 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 uh uh Permeate, permeate, permeate. Yeah. Oh snap! I got corrected by the mush mouth. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but that's what I'm saying. Uh, it's so embedded in this system now that that's why the system has to be destroyed. That's why it all got to go up in smoke or whatnot. Because everybody wants to be like Babylon, and Babylon is the epitome of wickedness on the planet. It's, it, it's absolutely 180 degree turn. For what you're supposed to be when it comes to your house, watching down the shot. Right. This is uh, Jeremiah 5. I'm going to start at um, 26. I'm going to go down. It says, For among my people are found wicked men. They lay wait as he a set of snares. They set a trap to catch men. All right. And, and this is, and, and, and you know, that's a wicked act. You know, although all Israel uh, is going to be saved, man, two thirds of our people are wicked as shit. All right. And um, uh, um, and that little minute and thir- uh, minute and eleven uh, video, video um, they thought it was um, uh, funny, man. Yeah, you yeah, know, it was cute. That was you know, like look, look, cuz. Mm-hmm. They were like, damn, that's fucked up. Damn, dog, you ain't got no hands. You can't think of something better to do with your hands than that. No, it was, it was like applauding the fact that of all the things he figured out how to do, he can roll up. They, were, they marveled at it. <laughs> Marvel at the bullshit. Marvel at the bullshit. We're going to get our, our father to help the great dignity. Okay, exactly, exactly. Right? Okay, this is verse 27. As a, now, this is going into the preachers, but still, it, it, it pertains to our people as well. As a cage is full of birds, or the house is full of deceit. Therefore, they become great and waxing rich. They are waxing fat, they shine, yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fathers, yet they prosper in the right of the needy, they do not judge. Well, you know what, though? Like I said, we didn't sit down yesterday about the motherfucking pastor that got his ass robbed and they don't put the church. So you see what I'm saying? So the wickedness is in every fucking corner. The men mm-hmm. that's supposed to be teaching, that's supposed to be the pillars of the community that is set up to look that way, and people will follow, the ones with the suits, the booty faces, and the expensive cars and the jewelry and shit, they would get as fuck too. Mm-hmm. So the wickedness. The wickedness is rolling all the way down here. All the way down here. Start starting with this either way and rolling through our community as well. This is, um. Yeah. Rule or rule? 
In Second Corinthians three and twenty one, for the first Adam be bearing a wicked heart transgressed and was overcome, and so be all they that are born of him. Yep, so the, the, the wickedness started right there. Okay, it picked up right there. You know, basic instruction. Don't, don't the trees. You can take of all the trees, but this wasn't talking about trees. It was, it was metaphorically speaking about talking, it's actually talking about people. All, all the people that's here, don't fuck with this one. Don't listen to the bullshit that he got to say. Don't fuck with it. Like, that's, a, that's a snake motherfucker, man. You keep you, you, your eyes up to him, and when they get seen your ass out here, how your ass is going to fuck up. And guess what? The snake knew that. That bad, that, 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 that ruthless motherfucker knew that. And they knew that the man won't go close. So what did he do? He ran like a bitch. He ran like a weak kind of bitch. And all the way he He's smarter than the man on the top level. Even to this day, and ran and ran and, and ran and broke the motherfucking law through her. And then she turned around and got the man to break the motherfucking law. Verse 22. Thus infirmity was made permanent, and the law also in the heart of the people, with the malignity of the root. So that the good departed away and the evil abode still, man. So all the fucking good in the earth was gone. It was that you know, turn it over to this wickedness. So that little bitty wickedness was spread to what the fuck we got right there. Yep. All of it. All of it. All this little wickedness started right there. Okay? And so the women wanna know, you know, they talk about men fucking the planet. No, y'all fucked it up. Y'all was the one that transgressed the law first. Okay? So so when we so when we get on our austere mode and decide, you know, say you don't have a chance to say all the dumb shit you need to say. You need to just shut the fuck up now. Cause everything you say, you can't even prove it or understand or even bag it up. But you just run and wrap it on your fucking emotions. Your emotions just got kind of fucked up in the first place. Go ahead. The Ecclesiastes ten and six. Folly is set in great dignity and the rich sit in low place. Go ahead. Yeah, I mean, that was folly, man. All right? The great dignity was held in, in that they were marveling and laughing. and actually had a competition with the guy with, with the two hands, man. Exactly. Can you, can, can you, can I outroll you? I got hands, but can I outroll you? And you ain't got no hands. A competition. You should be able to outroll them. You got hands, damn it. Mm -hmm. First of all, oh, all that shit is wicked. First of all, you play for damn. Seriously? Like a, like a, like Tariq Hill saying, let me see if I can now run the motherfucker with the, with the, with the uh, spring loaded on the bottom of his head. Cheek, little cheek, cheek. <laughs> on, on the bottom of his legs, because he, he done lost his leg. He lost the juice of his legs from his, below his knees down or whatnot. So he got these fucking braces that he can put on. He's got this fucking spring loaded shit so he can run. Tyreek said, I think I can beat him. Fuck it. He's supposed to. He's supposed to. Oh, yeah. yeah. That was it, you know, just a little quick hit, man. Pops, pops in charge, I was in charge. So um, with that, we want to say Kahala. Yahweh, by Hashem. Yahweh Shai, by Hashem. That was honestly possible with every great millstone. And today's time, we want to say Shalom and the Baba Bar. Welcome to another live lesson. The name of this one is Who Are the E's, the Cursed People, the Hunter. In this segment of the lesson, Lord's will be going to examine another trait of Esau, the Edomites. And uh, no matter how many times you go over this stuff, you know, you're going to have your naysayers, your yay-sayers, and whatever the case may be. But we're not concerned with that. We're just concerned with the will of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai to teach this word, <clears throat> continuously break down strongholds, and wait. For the Lord to take this place out and to 
vindicate us, so to speak, you know, and to make it known who are his chosen, because that's definitely what the Lord said he would do. Then shall be known who are my chosen. So we're going to go back to Genesis 25. We're going to read the 25th verse, and then we're going to read on down again. Um been dealing with the scoffer on the comment boards which I had to finally block because he ain't going to get it and uh, <clears throat> you know you always have these crusaders for Esau you know there's all kind of nations in the scriptures but for some reason they find themselves in the driver's seat of being a crusader for these Edomites unbelievable <laughs> <clears throat> 